Hey nerds, how you doing? Bree's here. Guess what? It's Earth Week. I like Earth Week because one of my kids was born during Earth Week because I'm a nerd like that. Now, what's the thing that happens in Earth Week? Hmm, we talk about a lot of stuff with the planet, what's good for it, what's bad, but I'm gonna take you back OG. Earth, what does Earth mean? What is Earth? If you think about it, you could talk about Earth like dirt, like soil. Where does soil come from? Like, what's it made of? Do you know? Did you know there's this thing called frass? It comes from worms. It makes soil. But what's frass? We'll get to that in a second. So in here, I have a compost bin that I've created. Um, and in here we have old fruits and vegetables that the reptiles didn't want to eat, sometimes that our rats didn't want to eat. And I put it in here with leaves and moss and all kinds of stuff. If you want to know more about composting yourself, put it in the doobly-doo and I'll help you out. Now, in my soil, I have worms. Let's see if I can find some in here. Hold that. And they're running because they're outside and they don't like sunlight very much because it makes them afraid. Why do you think that the earthworms don't like it in the sun? I'll give you three guesses. Is it because it's too hot? Is it because it's too bright? Is it because birds will eat them? What if it's all three? Because it's all three. So right here, trying to hide from me because it's like, oh, the light. This is a red wiggler. So they can be bigger than this. This is about a medium sized one because they're having babies in here. So this is a medium sized red wiggler and it's still moving. It's just freaking out a little bit because it's like, oh, the light, she burns but I have hundreds of them in this container right here. So they're living a good life, doing all the things, dripping on my leg, because that's what they do. So one of the things they create besides this soil, which side note, frass means worm poop. You're walking on worm poop. Is they make something called compost tea. Now this is the tea that comes from this one. And you'll see it kind of looks like tea. It's not clear. Kind of looks like a mint tea bag happened in there. And this stuff is fantastic for plants. Do you know which plants I use them for? I use them for the ones that we grow for our reptiles. So it's kind of like a circle of life. The reptiles don't finish their veg. I give it to the worms. The worms break it down. They give me soil for the vegetables. They give me water for the vegetables. I grow my vegetables. So. If you have any questions, comments, complaints, or queries about soil and how it works and how to make one, let me know. Put it down in the doobly-doo. If you wanna learn more about soil, put it down in the doobly-doo. If there's something else you wanna learn about, put it down in the doobly-doo. In the meantime, later nerds.